my name is Miss Rachel and welcome to Playfit at the East Hampton Library. Today we are going to start out with a book called The Plans I Have for You by Amy Parker. Then we're going to do some of the moves that we saw in our story. Let's get started. The Plans I Have for You written by Amy Parker. For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you hope and a future. Jeremiah 29, 11. Hey you, I've got big plans for you. Yes, you and you and you over there too. I need you in a hospital, and you at the zoo. You'll be an entomologist in a forest in Peru. You are my hands and my feet there on earth. I've given you a purpose. It's been there since birth. Oh, it's no little purpose. I don't do things small. Yours is the most humongous purpose of all. Yes, this job is for you, and only you can do it. I'm counting on you. So come on, get to it. You'll find what you need right there in your skin. I thought it all through when I put that stuff in. Patience, love, helpful, kindness. To you, I gave big hands. To you, two big feet. You'll be my big helper. You'll walk down big streets. I've left you instructions right here in my book. So open it often and take a good look. Favor, love, grace, patience, kindness, forgiveness. Remember that I, who made the whole world, made you, and there's nothing that, with my help, you can't do. So open your heart and listen real close. You'll find that one thing that you love the most. Hello you, welcome, we're glad you're here. Then, when you do, you just better watch out cause I'll send you big jobs to be inspired about. The whole world will be better Thanks to little old you. All because you did what I created you to do. What? You're still reading? There's so much to do. Now go out and find my big plans for you. That was such a special story. There is something for everyone out there. I love to teach movement to children and adults. I found the plan that God had for me. What's your plan? Sometimes it takes a little bit to figure out, but you got to figure out what makes you happy. We are going to start out by warming up our bodies with three different moves. Just follow after me, okay? Can you help me count though? We're just going to count to 10 each time. We're going to start with, out with 10 jumping jacks. Let's get started. So ready? I need some help counting to 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Awesome! Let's take a wide step. Arms come out to the side and we look like a starfish. We're gonna try to touch our opposite toe and stand up for 10 times, okay? Let's get started. Ready, set, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 
eight, nine, ten. Great job. Let's bring our feet together. Now we're gonna go up on our tippy toes and back down. We're gonna go up to releve, it's called, for 10 times again. Can you help me count one more time? Let's do it. One, two, try to go straight up and then down. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Shake it on out and let's repeat that one more time, straight from the top. And jumping jacks on your mark get set go one two three four five six seven eight nine ten wide step arms go out touch your opposite toe one two three four five six Seven, eight, nine, ten. Great job. Feet come together. Think tall, almost like a ballerina. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Shake it on out. Pause here, grab some water if you need, and come back for our first round. The first two moves we're gonna do are a nurse or doctor and the construction worker. So for our nurse or doctor, we're gonna make pretend we have our stethoscope. We're gonna take someone's heartbeat. Then we're gonna balance on one foot and write it down. And then switch sides. Balance and write it down. Heartbeat. Balance, write it down. Heart, beep. Balance, write it down. Awesome! Next, we're gonna do our construction worker. So, we're gonna work on hammering, and then we gotta carry the lumber, okay? So, hammer, go, go, go. And now let's carry. Make pretend you have a long piece of wood. Let's go back to hammer. Boop, 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 boop. Boop, 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 boop. Two, Carry. One. Awesome. Deep breath in and out. Awesome. Great job. Two, this one. time for our doctor, I want you to choose one foot and we're going to try to do everything while balancing, okay? So we're going to use our heartbeat. Let's use our stethoscope. Write it down. Stay on that one foot. Check that your heartbeat. Write it down. Let's check again and write it down. Awesome, great job. Deep breath in and out. Right back to our construction worker. Okay, so we gotta hammer in those nails. Boop, 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 boop. Boop, 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 boop. Maybe we're gonna saw a little. Now let's carry, carry the wood over. Let's do our hammer again. Boop, 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 boop. One. Boop, 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 boop. Awesome. Great job. Shake it out. Deep breath in. And out. Two. Try to remember which foot you were just balancing on and try the other foot this time. We're going to check the heartbeat. Whoa. And write it down. Make sure you're nice and balanced. Check for the heartbeat. Write it down. Oh, do you hear it? Boom, 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 boom. Boom, boom. Good job. Awesome. Deep breath in and out. Do you think we could use the jackhammer this time as a construction worker? Let's do it. Woo! Let's try that again. Boom, 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 boom. It's getting quicker. Awesome! Deep breath in and out. Okay, we have one more round of each. So you can choose to do whichever foot you'd like, okay? I'm gonna alternate. So I'm gonna check that heartbeat, write it down. 
I'm gonna switch feet. You can totally choose whatever feels best for you. Great job. Three, two, one, rest. Wonderful. Next, right back to our construction worker. What else Three, could we do? Two, one. Let's start out with carrying our lumber to our construction site. You gotta carry it all the way over. Now, let's use our saw. Shh, 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 Great job. Deep breath in and out. Shake it on out. Pause here, grab some water if you need, and come back for round two. For round two, we are gonna go back and forth between an artist and a soccer player. Follow along. So, we're, as an artist, we're gonna make pretend we have a huge canvas. You gotta throw paint on it. You can paint however you'd like. Big arms. You can use both arms. Try to get the whole canvas covered. Splash the paint. Use your brush, whatever you think is beautiful, okay? Deep breath in and out. Now we're gonna be a soccer player. So I like to do my toe taps on the ball. Then I'm gonna make pretend I'm dribble, 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 and kick. Awesome. Toe taps. Dribble, 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 kick that ball. Awesome. Toe taps. Try with the other foot. And shoot, and she scores. Goal. Awesome. Deep breath in and out. Right back to our artist. So you can draw something super tiny, like a little flower, or you can do a huge, huge movement that makes such colorful, abstract pictures. That means it doesn't really make sense, but it looks so beautiful. Splatter everywhere. Inhale and exhale. Right back to our soccer player. How about we do some headbutts this time? Maybe pretend that ball is right above your head. You gotta bounce it up. Stay right under that ball. Oh, awesome. You kind of just pop up. Make pretend you're gonna jump, but then you don't really leave the ground. You pop up quick. Don't leave the ground. Awesome. Deep breath in and out. Great job. Back to our artist. I'm gonna use my paintbrush this time. I'm gonna do big zigzags. Whoa, that looks so beautiful. Other way. Oh, what colors are you using? That looks so pretty. Zigzags down. And I'm gonna go zigzags and cross. Awesome. Deep breath in and out. Let's go back to, let's shoot some goals, okay? Score some goals. Practice those kicks. You can switch sides too. Awesome. And kick. Oh, let's do a little, ooh, behind the, behind the back. Little sneak attack. Great job. Inhale and exhale. Right back to our artist. Last time on each side for each move, okay? So this time I'm gonna throw paint. Throw it, throw it, throw it. Kinda looks like Jackson Pollock. Ooh. Do you know who that is? He was an abstract artist that lives right out in East Hampton here in Springs. Awesome! Splatter! Great job! Inhale and exhale. Last time we're doing our soccer player move, okay? Let's go back to our toe taps. Oh, and get ready to score that goal. And goal! Right back. Switch feet. Oh, goal! Awesome! Keep going and kick. Goal! Last one. And kick. Goal! Awesome! Inhale and 
exhale. Pause here. If you need to, grab some water and come back for our last round. For our final round, we're gonna go back and forth between a ballerina and an entomologist who studies insects. Let's start out with our ballerina. So tiptoe, we're gonna go right here, right on our tiptoes. Can you go back and let's move a little bit. And now try to balance. And we're gonna do an arabesque, it's called. Awesome. Tiptoe, tiptoe, tiptoe. Other side, arabesque. Try not to kick anything like that. Awesome, inhale, and exhale. So next one, we're gonna use our magnifying glass, and we're gonna try to balance and look down at our insect. You gotta get really close. Awesome. If you need to keep your back foot down as a little kickstand, totally fine. Check out those insects. Amazing! Inhale and exhale. So we're gonna start, this is called first position in ballet. We're gonna go up on our tippy toes, back down. We're gonna go to releve and down. Releve and down. Great job! Can you bring your arms up here? This is first position with our arms. Wonderful! Keep going, releve and down. Such a beautiful ballerina. Inhale and exhale. Okay. Right back to our insect. We're gonna check out those insects. Whoa! That one had a lot of legs. Whoa! <laughs> Remember, you can keep your foot down as your kickstand. Wow. Such beautiful wings that insect had. Inhale, and exhale. Right back to our ballerina moves, okay? So we're gonna go up on releve, and then we're gonna go to our arabesque. And let's go this way, and arabesque. Doesn't have to be the most graceful, as long as you are having fun, that's all that matters. Beautiful! Let's inhale, and exhale. Let's check out those bugs again. I don't usually like bugs, but this one's pretty cool. The magnifying glass makes it so much fun. Wow. I've never looked at insects this close before. Awesome. Which one's your favorite? Mine's the butterfly. So beautiful. Inhale. And exhale. Last time we're doing our ballerina. Let's go to our first position and let's go to releve and down. Can you bring your arms up here? Awesome. Can you bring one arm in front? So beautiful. Can you bring it out to the side? And back up. Let's do it with the other side too. Inhale, and exhale. Last time we're checking out those insects. Great job being an entomologist. That's a fancy word. Whoa. Wow. Keep going. We're not done. Amazing, deep breath in and out. Let's stretch out our legs a little bit. Heel down, toe up, and then reach towards your toe. Try to look up the whole time so your back doesn't round. You wanna keep it nice and flat. And switch. And switch, one more on each side. Switch. Let's bring one arm across. And switch. One more on each side. Last one. 
and let's take a deep breath in and fold over. Let's roll on up. One more time, deep breath in and fold forward. I'm gonna inch my toes towards another, one another, bend my knees and I'm gonna help myself round and roll my shoulders back to help me stand up. Awesome, give yourself a round of applause. Give yourself a huge hug because you did such an amazing job moving today and you should be proud of yourself. I'm so proud of you. And thank you so much for joining me for Play Fit at the East Hampton Library. See you next time.